Hi, Gospel Guitarist here with a video trying to clarify the monitor mix-up that seems to be going on with people. Um, this could be easily caused by these words right here. Monitor out. Now on most of the boards that we use for mixing in live environment and in the studio, this is an example of a studio monitor out left and right. Um, it's usually located near your headphones right here and somewhere in this main output section of the board. Now when you're wiring your stage in my other video I talk about how to set up a monitor mix where I'm talking about how to use the controls on the channels to set up the monitor mix but I don't go into how it's actually wired on the stage and things like that so people are getting I'm getting questions and feedback um, about the people wanting to use this and saying they are doing what I'm telling them and it isn't working um, well one of the problems with that is because when you do the setups using your auxiliary sends for your stage monitors that output is going to go out your um, auxiliary outputs so they're not going to be that signal is not available here this is just your stereo bus the exact same thing that comes out of here that you send down the snake to hit your main power amps or your powered monitor or powered speakers for the front of house. Um, these where it says monitor out are not meant to be used for stage monitors. This is for if you're using the mixer in your own home studio and you have a small pair of like Mackies like I have or Presonus speakers or something in your room and you run left and right out to your monitors which usually require, a, well, most of them have uh, accommodations for your quarter inch jacks. And so they differentiate on all the boards that I've seen and they, they label them monitor out but they use a quarter inch jack versus the type of XLR output that a snake would use on the snake sends going to a stage in a live environment. So if you're sending a signal from here, it's not that it can't be done, but you're not going to be able to personalize your mixes. The monitors on stage would just become two more of your main speakers. So everything would come out those um, speakers and you're not going to be using them as real monitors. Um, so when you're mixing on your board, as per se the other video that I instruct you on, then you run your uh, your auxiliary outs and then you run come out your auxiliary send I'm not on camera here yeah right here so you have auxiliary outs and you would say monitors would be on auxiliary one so you would run out of auxiliary one down your snake send to the stage and then from there you would run into your power amp and then from the power amp to your monitors on stage that way your auxiliary sends on each channel can control how much of each instrument each person on stage is wanting to hear in their personalized monitor mix. So just because it says monitor on your mixer doesn't mean stage monitors. Whenever it says monitor on your mixer it's talking about studio monitors. So I'm hoping this kind of clarifies that a bit because I get these questions and people go in that direction on my other video but I really don't go anywhere near that on my other video so I thought I'd make this video help clarify the outputs on the mixer I hope this helps um, leave comments below um, and that'll do it I hope that clarifies it thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe and uh, like and favorite and share thanks for watching